What's up everybody and welcome to TittmanParts.com. My name is Stitch and on this video I'm going to show you what comes in the Titman flatline barrel for the X7 Phenom. Alright, what comes in the kit, basically. <clears throat> Alright, so let's open it up. Real quick, we have a warning and installation manual instructions. The flatline barrel itself. Okay, I'll explain that in a minute. What else have we got in there? Yep. An extra fitting. I'll explain that in a minute. And then if you dig your hand in there, got a little baggie, throw that out of the way. All right, so you have a barrel sleeve, barrel cover, and a squeegee. That's cool. All right, let's put that to the side. And let me explain the stuff that we got going on right here. So it comes with two fittings. One fitting, one fitting is for the X7 standard which is this one right here. Okay, and then the other fitting on the flat line itself, let me take it out so I can show you guys, is for the Phenom, okay? If you get your kit and they're both not painted different colors, this is actually powder coated, okay? If they're not different colors, the other way to determine which one is which uh, basically is to learn how to read Tipman hieroglyphics. So I'm gonna take a crash course with, crash, course with you guys real quick right so if you can see right there you have a Y cut into the aluminum all right so that would show you that this fitting is for the Titman X7 Phenom okay and then on this one it'll have a straight line okay so that determines that that's for the X7 standard all right so those are the difference between the two. I think now they're making them two different colors. So the black one would be for the X7 standard. Okay, let me move on. I'll actually leave that out. Let me move on and explain the casing to you real quick. The plastic is going to be the same type of plastic that the front shroud is that comes with the Tim and X7. All right, so you got the same type of plastic there. So you know it's durable and it works. All right, you got the tactical rails on the top and bottom and also on either side. The tactical rails on either side are removable. Okay, the top and bottom are not. This comes in two pieces that are basically, you know, held together by screws. You have one, two, three, four, five, six Phillip head screws to hold the shroud together. All right, let me show you guys what it looks like without the X7, I mean the X7 Phenom without the flatline barrel. All right, and now I'm going to show you what it looks like with the flatline barrel. Okay, so here we go. This is the sneak peek on how your X7 Phenom is going to look with the flatline barrel attached to it. Okay, so now as usual, this is the... This is the standard shroud that comes with the X7 Phenom, and it goes up to about there. So you get that extension, which is about like two inches more. So you get more room for the front grip, and you can attach a camera for vanity or a flashlight, a tactical flashlight, a forward grip. All right, there'll be links below for a whole bunch of variety of stuff, which is basically just the link to tippingparts.com. Okay, the front sights fit on as well. Alright, so that's how it looks. Okay. For a video on how to install the Tipman Flatline Barrel, please look in the description below. Alright, and then I'm gonna do a separate separate video on how to switch out the fittings as well. So keep an eye out for that. My name is Stitch once again with TipmanParts.com. Thank you for watching. Later.